And welcome to the Estadio Ciudad de Valencia with its capacity of 26,000. It dates back to 1969. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Levante up against Real Sociedad. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Roger losing possession a bit easily. So the starting 11 for Real Sociedad. Oyar Tabal plays with Adnan Yanuzai in the wide areas. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Rico. And a fine cross. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. And a short corner, let's see. And he could be in proper trouble here. And what can they do to stop him running at them? Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Roger. Radoya. Now potential danger. Oh, it almost did the trick for them. Great defending. Jorge Miramon, excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Mikel Marino, it's with Oyar Sabal. Diego Rico, every pass hitting its target. Mikel Marino, that's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Well, that is how to play advantage. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Alexander Surlot. Spot on with that tackle. Roger. Here's Morales. And showing fine vision. Well, nothing comes of it in the end because the flag has gone up, Stuart. Well, he knew where the space was, but he's just been too eager, and that's why he's offside. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. High quality defending. Diego Rico. It's with Mikel Marino. Oh, great vision. And he's in the clear. And there it is. The opening goal. 1-0. And they'll feel they deserve it. Well, as you can see here, it all starts with a perfectly weighted ball in behind the defenders. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Ennis Bardi. Here's Morales. Good tackle.
Alexander Surlot. It's with Oyar Sabal. Mikel Marino. Excellent ball over the top. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Now can they counter clinically? Son. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. Well, the referee remaining very much in control. Now the card, and it's yellow. Son. Chance to play it in. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Can someone get on the end of this? And clearing is away. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. <whistles> the two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Alexander Surlot now with Rafinha can they find a gap in the defence David Silva he's lost it and the referee felt he had to blow the whistle and pushed onto the woodwork and at the second time of asking it's a goal the keeper, meanwhile, looks to the heavens. Well, as you can see, it's an error from the goalkeeper. You just can't split it into a dangerous area like that. Second goal for them here. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Adnan Yanuzai. Lafinha. Alexander Surlot giving the ball away. The attack looks promising. But nothing comes of it. Well, no surprise there. Real Sociedad have had more of the possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here. And it makes them such a good team. It's... Oh, could be. Defending by example. Oh, did so well to deny him. Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. Corner kick played in. It hasn't come to very much. Roger. Campagna. Opportunity here. Keeper getting the touch. And thumped away. Well, you won't see too many better saves than that. It was just brilliant. Diego Rico. 
It's opening up for them. Silva. Could be. Well, getting in the way. Superb save. Here it is now, a substitution. And over comes the corner. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Next to go short. Cutting the ball back. Has a go. Keeper did his job to begin with. And I think the threat has been averted. Morales. Roger. Now with Bardi. They've lost it. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Chance to play it in. Throw-ins given. And the referee now going back to deal with the earlier incident. A yellow card it's going to be. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Chance to cross. Isaac. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. favoured a short one here went in strongly to win the ball and just five minutes remaining Oyar Sabal and it's with Isaac and a goal to put the final stamp on it that will do it Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. This is going to be a thrashing. 3-0 now. Three minutes of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. De Frutos. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.
And a fine 